Hey Gravelers, Morgan Murray with Desert Gravel and Cotuit. Spring has started to happen out here in the Colorado Utah borderlands and um, out for a little training ride today and it made me realize that it's probably timely to talk a little bit about training. Most of you should have our training plans that I created to get ready for Cotuit 2022, 12 weeks which starts in a couple of days. And just made me think about um, some reminders for you in your training. First and foremost, the whole point of me creating Cotuit and this riding out here and the training plans is to have some fun. Uh, not easy type one fun, but type two, type three, hard, you know, kick in the pants kind of fun. Uh, so keep that in mind as you go through your training and as you're riding out here, make it a good time. Uh, it's hard. The training is hard, the riding can be hard, but as you make that journey, remember, remember to enjoy yourself. Uh, the training plans that I've created are specific to the type of fitness you need to build to be out here, which has two primary components, especially for you longer course riders. You need a lot of endurance to come out here and ride far and long. Um, I'm at about 65 miles today on the 125 course and it's not easy getting out here. Um, so, so endurance building for all of you, those long weekend rides are really important. But also, as you see in this picture, when you're looking out here, it's pretty flat looking and vast and open and easy. And that mindset is really deceiving because if you look at the elevation profiles and the gain that you get in all the courses, it's quite a lot of elevation for the amount of time that you're out here. And fortunately or unfortunately, all of that elevation comes in really short, often very steep, punchy little climbs. I'm out here at the No Lot Lizard Lounge uh, at the top of our steepest climb on the Cotua courses. It actually hits 30%. Um, I could show you, it's only, you know, quarter of a mile long, but you know, one after the other, after the other of these is really a bit of a kick in the teeth. So you're cruising along nice and easy. And then you get, you turn this corner and you see, Oh crap, this punchy little climb. And you got to, you know, crank up the Watts, crank up the effort. And, uh, it's really short, high intensity bursts of effort. So you'll find in your training plans, especially early that there is a lot of high intensity, short, um, interval work and that specifically is to get you and your system ready for this really snappy full attention uh, hard efforts and then they're over so short recovery periods short bursts of effort because that's how it's going to be on your ride so a lot of those uh, I subscribe to the model in training that you do the things that are less specific to your race in the beginning and the more specific things to your race in the end so we start with the less specific, which is those high intensity sessions, because that's a smaller part of your training program. And we end towards the end of your programs, you'll see with a lot more endurance building and really long hour intervals and those long training weekend rides. So that's the method to the madness and it seems to, to be pretty effective. So um, I think that's it, you know, please feel free to ping me with any questions, Morgan at DesertGravel.com specifically. If you have general questions at the event, you can reach out to any of the Dino Wranglers at info at desertgravel.com. We're here to help. Uh, we're here to get you as ready as you can be. So remind yourself that the more work you put in now as you're training, the easier and more enjoyable it's gonna be when you come out here. And you know, uh, anybody that knows me knows that I like, <laughs> I like things that are tough and hard, but I also like it enjoyable. So. Um, especially for you long course riders. You know, get the training in, do the work, so that when you come out here, it's not always head down and oh shit moments. It's more like, oh my gosh, look how amazing it is out here and you're not cross-eyed and you can actually take it all in. So thanks for joining us. We've still got a little bit of room. So if you've got friends and family that are thinking about joining us, we'd love to have them. And it's gonna be one hell of a ride, my friends. So cheers, train well. Stay healthy. Gravel on, my friends. Cheers. Oh, I gotta go do my intervals on this show. <laughs> it's not a lot.